welcome back to another War Command video, and this time I am doing some random thing that they updated and wanted to check. And it is the... It's the recon drop. It allows you to find things on... That are, um, find things that are relative to your base position. It will go no more than 50 hexagons away from your base. And basically how it works is you push this, and it finds the nearest player base and tells you the distance. And it'll keep on going consecutively based on distance. So basically, um, it'll go from nearest to second nearest to third nearest all the way to 50 hexes away. It works on metal deposits, oil deposits, rogue faction bases, and it will open up your bookmarks. Um, the number is by hexagon, so that rogue faction base is four hexagons away from me. And it works for thorium deposits, so it will be extremely helpful during thorium drops. Um, and that pretty much is this update. Really cool, I like it, and I know a lot of people will like it. And while, hold on. While I'm on that topic, I would like to discuss things. The gold. Almost all of my War Commander videos, unless I specify otherwise, are on a preview server. And we really recognize it because I have 6,000 gold. And since I have 6,000 gold, I did not pay 600 bucks for his kicks. I gave it to him so I don't have to worry about repairs. They don't change it. Every time you sign into a preview server, you get 6,000 gold. Another question I always get is... Can I join you so I can get the 6,000 gold? There's really no point. I will coin upgrades just to show you. Look, I'm coining this upgrade. Look, I will sign, when I sign on the war, next war, on the real war command server, it will not work. That thing will still be whatever level it was before, and I still have to wait for all that time and whatever. So, gold on upgrades on the preview server does not work, so don't bother me on that, please. And what else was there? This is not Sector 1. This is the preview server. So, I'm not on Sector 1. Don't even think about trying to add me to get to Sector 1. Next, do not ask to add me on Facebook, please. Overdrive the enabled. The whole point of me making a Facebook page was so I can message you guys and not add Overdrive you guys Overdrive disabled. Okay, I need to turn that off. Yeah. The whole point of Facebook is so I can communicate with you guys without adding to my Facebook group. I really don't want random people on my Facebook group. Please, stop it. Please. And I think that covers everything I want to cover. Remember, leave a like, subscribe, leave a like, comment, and subscribe. Subscribing is anything. Feedback, please let me know. And what else was I going to say? Um, oh, I hope you guys like my new intro and outro. I spent a little bit of time on it. My YouTube partnership did get me, through Social Blade, got me um, access to Audio Micro's music for free. Any music on there, I can download for free. So basically, whenever I do montage or whatever, I have music for free as long as I credit them. So, expect more music in my videos now since I don't have to worry about copyright. That was the only reason why I didn't add music in a lot of my videos was because due to copyright except for my outro. Because I had decent permission to use that in my outros. But now I have a new intro and outro, so I don't have to worry about that. So, give me some feedback on that. If you didn't give me feedback on my last video, one, one of the two videos I have so far that have it right now will be up. And tell me what you think. So, I will see you guys later, and good luck.